and welcome to Joburg Today. My name is Dumi Tlapo, bringing you the best of what's going down in and around Johannesburg. It's common knowledge that there is a shortage of skilled engineers in South Africa. So when the University of Johannesburg realized that their engineering students did not have enough practical experience, it created a company called Resolution Circle to employ them. That's something we've done is to commercialize products. And that's the idea to product or, the, or barcode concept we came up with. And these products, where do you get these product ideas from? Um, mostly from entrepreneurs come and pitch it. We do competitions. Um, there's a few from the city that we do on behalf of the city. People just pitch up. And how that. is that working for them? Obviously, this interns need various skills. They can't just do product development. They also need maintenance skills mm -hmm. and so on. So we train them for six months in workshops, uh, massive workshops, uh, about 300 seaters workshops that we train them spend the year with us. They get paid salary. Um, I think we're about 300 at the moment, which gives us a very nice skills base. Mm -hmm. We have uh, uh, professionals and so on that work with them. So the customer never see the student, they sort of work with the professionals. But then we break it down and then we work, they do the jobs in the various uh, facilities and so on. Sure. Give us a sense of the facilities. So we raised about just under 400 million just for facilities. So, okay, it gives you the idea of size here. Mm -hmm. yeah. So there's about 40 facilities that can support entrepreneurial things. And that's really from 3D printing, simulation, right through to laser cutting and injection molding and manufacturing and carpentry. It's everything you need to do a business a, a product idea to bark out with very little in terms of constraints. <laughs> wow, very impressive. Now, the youth that are actually involved, mm. the concern would be because they're inexperienced. Obviously, you did say you provide training. Has there been any concern around product uh, quality? Um, I think just to give you an idea of numbers, it's about 150 professional personnel on staff mm -hmm. um, and just under 300 students. So you, you're already a one on two, one to two. So you do mentorship, you do, and there's various layers. So most of them are technicians, artisans, engineers. Mm. So there's a very tight program that we work on. I'm sure there's nothing more rewarding than actually creating a product. Yes. Give us a sense of the type of products that are coming out of Resolution um, Circle. Okay, now there's a lot. Um, I think I just did, before I came here, it's about just over 50 that we've done in the last two years. Um, what we also do is we partner with incubators. So Standard Bank's incubator, for example, uses as its technical. We do work for the incubator in Pretoria. We did a product for a company that pitched. Um, he actually went ahead and won the International Water Design Award. Mm -hmm. And he's rolling it out now. And having said that, we're focusing on areas like, I would like to call it the wicked problems of Africa, water, energy, mm -hmm. employment, and things like that. So it's really the area we try to play with. Mm -hmm. I think we're really trying to, to help Africa in, as well. And I like manufacturing. It has a, a, a way of equalizing the Gini index. Like us on Facebook, JoeBigToday.tv, and follow us on Twitter at JoeBigToday. So they say gadgets are a guy's best friend. Well, maybe in Leroy's case, who took the time to explore the latest of gizmos on the market. So my producer, Riley, thought it would be a great idea for me to do a show on technology. There's only one problem. I'm not so techno-savvy, which is why I'm here to find out what's on the market. Francois, first question. What is techno savvy? Well, I think being techno savvy means moving with technology. So everything's getting smaller, faster, louder. And uh, ask any Apple fan. Um, you can buy an Apple product today, and in a week's time, it's outdated. So I think uh, moving with technology, that's being techno savvy. How important is it to be techno savvy, especially as a consumer? Well, you know, with things moving so quickly, you can have a, a, an i3 notebook. And um, that same notebook bought two years ago today can probably do um, twice, as well, twice what it could have done uh, you know, when you bought it. Um, software is updating all the time and uh, using features um, within the, the hardware. Um, so if you don't really move with the time, you know, especially in a business environment, um, your competitors that are moving with the time, you're going to be left behind. 
Now, how often do I need to actually be looking at trends uh, pertaining to technology? It's funny you ask that because most um, products come with a manufacturer's warranty, or they all do, between one and two, and some of them three years. And that's kind of a good guide to see um, how long a product um, you know, would be current. Um, so for instance, uh, a product that's only got a one-year warranty is probably an entry-level device. Something that's got a, a three-year warranty is probably a business device and will come with a next day um, business warranty, warranty on site and, and that kind of thing. So why don't you show me what's hot on the technology market? Sure. What we got here first is a brand new product exclusive to Incredible Connection. Mm -hmm. It's called the Click X10. What it is, it's a Windows tablet, a 10-inch Windows tablet. Yeah. Um, we call it a two-in-one or a convertible because there's your tablet, which you can take into lectures, uh, you can sit it with it at home, whatever you want to do. And then, when you want it to be a fully functional notebook, you clip the keyboard on and you've got a, a notebook. All right, why don't you tell me about these two products right here. So what we have here are the um, Ultimate Ears um, range, also brand new and exclusive to Incredible Connection. Um, this is the, the Mega Boom and this is the Boom 2. Now these, what's special about these is they're shockproof, waterproof and have excellent sound quality. Now what about these babies here? Because when you were talking to me earlier about everything else, I couldn't help but kind of Google <laughs> on these. What are they? Um, these are wireless earphones which aren't incredible in themselves mm -hmm. but what's great about them is they've got built-in um, it's got a built-in heart rate monitor mm -hmm. okay so um, you can get a lot of um, you get a lot of earphones that are wireless but not all of them come with the heart rate functionality they have incredible sound quality uh, really amazing the best that I've heard in any wireless um, earbud and what's the price range for for such a box uh, these retail for three triple, sorry two triple nine and this one here looks kind of familiar. Yes. So this is an old faithful, really. Uh, I say old because there's a lot of newer models out uh, at the moment. This is a 13-inch MacBook Pro. Um, why we are showing you this one is because um, with things getting smaller, faster, lighter, um, it's also good to have something that's not as current. But you see, this is still a current range with an incredible connection. And still reliable, no doubt. Yes, of course. It comes with a, you know, the full warranty. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's brand new. Um, what's great about it is it's got a, um, a CD drive, which not a lot of the new ones are coming out with. All right. All right. It also has a, a slot for an SD card, great for photographers um, and video editors. And then it's also got a Firewire port, which is uh, very important for fast data transfer speeds when you're doing video editing. All right, no problem. This is an i5 with a, um, I think it's a 500 gig hard drive. All right, pretty good. And is this a standard or they're bigger? They're bigger, they're smaller, this is kind of middle of the range, and this one's, uh, I think, going for 16000 These gadgets are ideal for the person on the go who enjoys using technology to its fullest potential. They're user-friendly, efficient, and worth the investment. I'm Leroy, Man About Town. Hi guys, my name is Boyti and you're watching Joburg Today. That's all for today, but do check out Leading Opinion with Nashina. From myself, Dumin Tlapo and the Joburg Today team, it's goodbye.